Nature shows you that all the time. In any vagina that delivers any essence of manifestation, you will always find that which encompasses all the universal uterus. See? And you will notice that they're all shaped like phalluses, but when you look through the cavity, it becomes a uterus, even inside of the phallus. So let's say this is the phallus. Look inside of the phallus and you will find a universal uterus, AKA pussy. That is the principle of life. You can never have a male greater than the female because from the female came the male, and to the female must the male return. Even when he puts his semen into her coochie, it's nothing but him returning back to that which he is encapsulated in all the time anyway. So you see, the whole concept of there being a spiritual male god, but no spiritual female goddess, is going to be something that was given to you by a chauvinistic male. And if this male only has one complexion, meaning one nationalism, European, then we'd probably be suspicious of the fact that someone is trying to fuck with our heads and make their racial ethnicity be superior over mine. <coughs> Otherwise, why would I look in the mirror and see my beautiful black face and then fathom or fashion a god for myself that looks like the degenerative facial characteristics of the man who steals everything and enslaves me and wants to make my children as well as my wife be nothing but prostitutes, drug addicts, homosexuals, prisoners, or warmongers. Now why would I want to worship that as my god? Because violence and deprivation makes it where when I worship you as my god, I get the privileges of the earth back that you naturally stole from me. Because see, you're not gonna sit on this planet and have wars after war after war and manufacture nothing but weapons of destruction and destroy whole cities like Detroit without the universe neighbors, contrary to your lie that we're all alone in the universe. No, we're not. Someone's fucking with your head. Now imagine a tenement building with 17 floors. And you live on the <coughs> basement floor. You have an apartment down in the basement. You can't get on the other floors because you're limited to the basement. But you know there's 17 floors. Because when you come into the elevator, though your car would only allow you to go to the first floor and the door would only open on the first floor for you, you can see the register saying there's 16 more floors in the building. So through your observation, of what's available on the register, you should be able to consume in your mind the thought that if I can dwell on floor one in the basement and there is 16 other floors, is there a possibility that someone might live on those other floors or a conglomerate of someone's on the other floors? Could this be the dynamics true and existing and my reality as something that cannot be perpetuated as fully thought? Yes. So if you go outside at night and you look up into the sky and you see 16 more floors, which is more like 50 trillion more because you can see how many floors there is if you know that a floor is a star and if you know that a star is a sun that has to have planets around it too, just like our sun here has planets around it, then only ignorance or misleading concepts that you got from a book will be more powerful than your observation of nature. This is what I mean. Why would I let the albino, mutated, warmonging, white man, want to be worshiping God, hate his own woman, give me a book that I should fathom my consideration of how the universe works off of when I can look at him and see that he is degenerate and wants to be made. And I'm not saying this to be me, but I'm sure all you melanin recessive people have thought it over in your own head that 
I think I'm missing my blackness. I gotta be honest with myself. I need to do more than just go to stupid ass tanning salon. Which, by the way, I was just hanging out doing my thing the other day. And I wanna show you what I found. Look at this. It says, be natural. And then it shows you this beautiful white lady face. And then in order for her to be natural, they give her some instructions at the bottom. That says, for free tan. See? So that means that somewhere, you white people are aware of the fact that your natural skin color has been removed. Someone just confessed right there in the magazine that was trying to sell you a tanning moment so you can use the light. I was gonna say sunlight. But see, you guys have come up with synthetic sun because the sun gave us that information. You do know that, don't you? The sun said, make a little sun so you can have me inside of your dwellings on command on demand because that's how the sun gets down it gives us ideals that is suited for us to live in harmony with it and it also showed us how to make electricity without having to burn up the melanin that's in the earth that you Europeans love to do because it's profitable but unnecessary but yet profitable and so again the recessive white God Jesus is destroying his alleged own creation because see he created his own woman and gave her a vagina and then later decided that for some reason I don't want this vagina and this woman to reign superior oh because I'm God and I'm God and my mother Mary fuck her because she is not God she is just the Virgin Mary which is a bunch of bullshit because she's God's mother now if you push God out of your vagina it's gonna be really hard for you to remain a virgin even though you push God out because see Whether going in or out, if you pass something that big out of your vagina, it's not virgin anymore. It has been penetrated from the inside out. So if you never got no outside in penetration, you got an inverted penetration, which is still a penetration, which constitutes her ass. Can't be. So dumb shit is dumb shit, and this is why our world is fucked up, because the same dumbass people who want everyone to vibrate on that foolishness forever is living very well at Applebee's and Popeyes and every place else they go and spend the money off of the other nations of people neglect by receiving their foolish Bibles in your own native language nice people to worship the image of these same people that gave you the damn Bible as your God and you're supposed to remain that stupid forever so it's like shut the fuck up Asar and we don't want you to do well and see we know that because we've observed what goes on on the earth forever and we anticipate it the foolish response from you white people as well as you dumbass black people who don't even see how important it is to support us are because he's fighting for your liberation and for your returning to your God knowledge but the problem is we destroyed the God knowledge to begin with because we wanted all these festations of crime and sin and filth decadence so the white people are really just if you want to know the truth about it tutoring 
of the mastermind, melanated people, that introduced all this foolishness about the less melanin you have, the better you could be, the better privileges. Cause see, this is black melanin people attacking more melanin people. And I know that, even if the rest of you guys don't. So to make a long story short, you white people really believe that us brilliant, intelligent black people will let a few handful of your crazy, no thinking asses, can't even be smart enough to understand that pussy is more important than dick. And I say that because you white women support that stupid shit too, along with these dumbass black women. I mean, when you sit there with pussy and you know your pussy pushed out all the dick <coughs> that you make a fool out of yourself trying to worship and put above you, it's only because of brainwashing and carnal impressions. So now you being a woman has been reduced where you find yourself begging men to support you when the whole idea of a man even being on the earth comes from you supporting the first nine months of his ingestion and then the next 21 years of his mental as well as physical development only for him to start calling you a bitch when he's seven years old something has gone awful wrong i'll tell you what it is it's religion mainly christianity the same religion that tells you it's okay to beat your child as well as your wife and so does islam and so does judaism and they also tell you that war is okay because it's war. So God's gonna overlook it. <coughs> As a matter of fact, our white ass God will ordain it. War is an ordainment that is registered through lack of God knowledge. See, the Federation is not warring with anyone. The Federation is eradicating Impurities. Impurities are what you could call small breakages off of systemized, sanitized, specialized, specified life forms. These life forms, because they're packed of greatness, can reduce and create small life forms that is not full of true knowledge of self these things are susceptible to getting information from books that is wrong information that will make you be an idiot now let me explain to you what I just said the break off of the melanated people is a species of people on earth now that call themselves white these people have been given foolish books knowledges of arranging moments of barbarism and states of consciousness that keeps them in a state of frozen idiocy where they don't want to do anything but have sex, collect materialism, and have repeated violence. And then more sex, more collection of materialism, and then more violence. More sex, more collection of materialism, more violence. <coughs> These are the basic fundamentals. You are the only people I know will build machinery that you can climb into and get whipped around and get your body all messed up and torn apart and actually paid to get, to get involved with an activity that puts you on the edge of dying. All this comes from foolishness and lack of love for self. Back to the heart. Only way you could be finding yourself locked up on this planet where you return and complete nothing but acts of barbarism and acts of violence against other people.